Sen saw an opportunity for an early kill. He didn't understand that the White Wolf Unicorn Beast's soul had already been claimed by the legendary Sarah Aaron. What's your problem? You some kind of ass freak? Ass freak! <laughs> <laughs> No one is to help this ass freak. He hunts alone. Do you understand me? Earlier that day. Are you Sen? How'd you know? Your friends paid me to show you the ropes on the first day. They must have a lot of money to spend. Yeah, they do. And you do not, which is why you are here. That's why a lot of us are here. Let's go. Watch the ridge line. Keep your head in a swivel. I'm sorry, I don't know more about God's sanctuary. I just heard that if I did well here, I could Earn four million dollars in a week. Well, that's not the way it works. It takes people a long time to make that kind of money. Yeah, well, I don't have any other options. All right. What you have to remember that this is not like your home planet. They discovered God's sanctuary while trying to master teleportation. And here's the interesting thing. Technology does not work here. Guns, bombs, none of it works. First men just hunted to protect themselves from the beasts in God's sanctuary. Without technology, they had to go back to the old ways. Bows, blades, shields, spears. Some prefer arrows. The greatest discovery was not teleportation. The thing that happens when you eat the meat of your kill, you evolve. Evolve? If you eat the flesh of your kill, you get faster, you get stronger, you can even extend your life. I like the sound of that. Be careful, Sen. Some people come here to build themselves up, but others, they're already strong, and they just want more. The most important thing you have to remember, there are no laws here. The rules of your home planet will not protect you here. The weak die, the strong survive. But the clever, Clever thrive. Six months later. Sen wasn't evolved enough to fight Coppertooth Panther. If he wanted to live, he'd have to outrun her. To survive, my family needs four million dollars. And the only way for me to get it was to come to God's sanctuary. <laughs> die, tiger, die! Oh, brother. It's a panther. You don't even know what creature you kid. Panther, tiger, who cares? You're just jealous of my beast soul. A beast soul sword? Come on. Help me take this back to the steel armor shelter. Fine. But I'm not jealous. It's not even sacred blood. No one even knows when the last sacred blood beast soul was found. Hunter's been looking for it their entire lives. If Sen could find a sacred blood beast soul, he could take on those copper tooths and get the money he needed for his family. All right, I guess I better get something for my troubles. All right, let's see if you're worth something. Ordinary beetle kills. No beast soul gain. Yeah, yeah, ordinary beast soul, whatever. Time to level up. One ordinary Geno point gained. With each bite, Sen gained more Geno points. I can feel it. So slow. At this rate, I'll never reach my first evolution. Huh? Easy. Gotcha, little guy. Sacred blood beetle killed. Sacred blood beast soul gained. Sacred blood beast soul? 
There's no way I'm awake right now. I... I gotta be dreaming, right? <laughs> right? Or... Did I just get lucky enough to stumble upon a sacred blood beast? Uh, uh. <sighs> Probably tastes like what the wealthy eat back home on Roca. <laughs> Flesh of sacred blood beetle eaten. One sacred geno point gained. Sacred geno point? I like the sound of that. Sen could feel the Geno points making him stronger, faster. He couldn't get enough. He wanted to make sure he didn't waste any of it. He needed the Sacred Blood Geno points to evolve. But then, Sen found something he wasn't expecting. Is that what I think it is? More copper tooths. What are you doing? Are you following us? No, I was just hunting for beetles. Come out of the shadows! That's a beast soul dagger. I said, come out of the shadows. The great Sarah Aaron didn't really care about this low level hunter until. Wait. Don't I know you? Ass freak. It's you, isn't it, you little pervert? <gasps> I thought you knew to be careful around these parts. Don't you remember that I told you if I saw you again, I'd kill you? I could, you know. There are no laws on God's sanctuary. I could order any of my men to kill you and there would be no repercussions. Not even on whatever backwater planet you come from. Do you remember who I am? You're Sarah Aaron. Miss Aaron, we're ready to move. Coming! I'll kill you next time. There's a sacred blood beast nearby and the hunt is on. Sarah Aaron was leader of the Bullseyes. With legendary fighting skills, she was close to evolving into the second level of God's sanctuary. See you around, Pastor. They likely would have killed me for this crystal. Whatever it does, if it came from a sacred blood beast, it has to be something special. something like this end up in a bug? Hey, looks like ice freaks back from hunting. <laughs> Wonder what sort of creature he tried skewering this time. It's a shame that we let someone like him in, ass freak. I don't mind it on the hunt. This is where I miss technology the most. Sen received Geno points from the beetle's flesh, but he knew he could get more from the shell. But what he was really focused on was the crystal. Sen wondered if the crystal would evolve the lizard. Maybe just one tier of evolution. Okay, good, you ate it. Nothing? Great. What am I supposed to do with you? I'll deal with you later. Sen, status report. Sen, not evolved. Status, none. Estimated lifespan, 
200 years. Evolution status, 100 geno points required. Geno points, 86. Sacred blood geno points, 8. Beast souls, 1. Sacred blood golden beetle type armor. Armor? I wonder what it looks like. Every sacred blood beast soul gives something different. Some give weapons, but this one gave something else. seen something so gorgeous. It's far more superior than the primitive beast soul armor I used to be jealous of. And it weighs nothing. I can't even feel it. Interesting. You evolve to the next tier. No, you don't. Not with my crystal. It didn't even hurt. Primitive green scale lizard killed. No beast soul gained. Gain zero to ten geno points randomly. I wonder what other creatures I could transform. Sen decided to go to his home planet to find out more about the crystal. Hurry up! I don't got all day to wait for you to stroll through the teleporter. Put a little oomph in it! Look, I'm going just like everybody else. Hey, it's Ass Freak. Let me guess. Gotta run back home because nobody here wants to resupply you for your next hunt. <laughs> I knew it! Oh, am I bothering you? You want me to... What's that? A beast soul soul for little ass freak? Sen wished he could use his sacred blood beast soul. But not yet. Soon, Sen thought to himself. I think it's your turn to teleport. Broca, take me home. Sen's home planet of Roka was a far cry from the primitive world of God's sanctuary. Coming from poverty, Sen never rode in a skyship or went to a star scraper, but it was still home. Ye crew president has entered the fourth level of God's sanctuary. And I haven't even gotten beyond first level yet. Speaker of the house killed the demigod sea star yesterday, the first to accomplish this feat. Good for him. Rykart Galaxy Prodigy, Lang, has extended his lifespan to 300 years using 100 mutant Geno points. On the frontier planets, the Shura have attacked once more, resulting in a devastating loss of life. Finally. Susanna, I am not trying to bully you. Susanna, stop. You know that you and your kids have been living in a house that is only one third yours. The rest belongs to us. After Sen's father died, his aunt and uncle showed his mother no respect at all. Come on, mom, stand up to them. We have been generous enough to allow you and your kids to stay in this house, even though it's not yours. I just don't think Susanna, you are not listening. We are not trying to cheat you. We've never even asked you to pay rent. We wouldn't want to. We're family. Sen couldn't stand watching his mother being treated this way. Come on. You're my ticket away from these people. My whole family depends on you. This house is now worth more than three million. Mm -hmm. We should jump on the opportunity and sell now. Susanna, you have two options. If you really want to stay, then just pay us our two thirds, two million, and it's all yours. That isn't a choice at all. You know I don't have that kind of money. And where would we live? Son, 
What are you doing here? What are you gonna do? What will Sen do next? Will Sen always be alone on God's sanctuary? How will Sen use the sacred beast blood soul he discovered? Listen to Supergene on Pocket FM to find out.